This is one freaky looking turtle when we get to its head. That always looks more like a fish to me than a turtle. <laughs> I tried to kill the dragon. Yeah, this seems like a slightly less interesting video. Um, that's probably because I don't have a whole lot left I can say about Golden Axe. I, I wanted to get through... And these videos are just as much about me wanting a record of the things I've accomplished as it is me wanting to make videos for other people and say witty, entertaining things. And the fact is, is uh, I wanted to beat this game with, with all three characters and kind of put some closure on it. Say I've played Golden Axe, but... I don't really, I said pretty much everything I really have to say about it uh, in the first installment of this. I'm not a big fan of the game. Um, I, I put it on the list because it's a fan favorite and because uh, it's important and it's one of the first beat em ups, which is one of my favorite genres, but it's probably my least favorite within that genre. And there's this. The old double, double tap punch, which I'm having some trouble doing on this controller today. You could die. Die already. Jesus. My metal bikini is starting to chaff. Magic I don't need. Probably would have used some of that magic had I remembered that this was here. This is definitely a character that level memorization is good for. Alright. I'm gonna go ahead and take some hits here because I want to save my magic for when this guy comes out. This time there really is something up there. It's <laughs> something will come out of those doors. I know I remember this. It's only been a week since I played this game. <laughs> I should remember more than I do. Like I said, it's been a long week. And... Tomorrow's Thanksgiving, so... It's only gonna get longer. Oh, please let me keep my magic, please. There we go. Look at that! Damn! Still didn't kill him. Can you believe that? That's the worst part. It wouldn't be so bad if, like, alright, I used level 6 magic, and so they reduced me down to level 5. That would be fine. But that's not what happened. They took away everything. See, he was a lot easier to kill, though, after that. But I'm gonna look at... You can see I only have one life left, so... I'll probably end up, um... Having to use a continue fairly early. That was weird. Did you guys see how I killed that guy? I've never done anything like that before. I don't even know how to describe it. I like I started just studying at his feet, and then I, I all it I it didn't look like it was hurting him really. He was shaking, but it wasn't really. Usually, after a couple of swipes, she'll do something to make him fall to the ground. That didn't happen. Instead, when I got up and and did my little jump attack, he just died.
like to imagine that's not red boots she's wearing. Those are black boots that have been soaked in the blood of her enemies. Or maybe they're socks. They might be red socks. She probably shouldn't be walking around in socks. Or a bikini. But it's not the point. What is the point, you say? The point is, I wish I had more magic before I came here. I'm starting to get a weird feeling about these bonus levels, too. Like, when they offer you meat and potions, I think you have to pick. Like, you only get so much before the thieves run away. So you have to uh, decide which one you want. I like her pose there, that's pretty cool. Good counter. See? Ah! Uh, Everyone knows what mistake I made. I tried to use a normal technique against one of these guys. Oh, it never ends. Come on. I actually did look at the arcade footage, um, which I had never seen before. I was too young to really go to arcades in 1989, um, but I had never seen the arcades for Golden Axe or um, Altered Beast. And I, I watched both of them after watching some Let's Plays for, uh, for both games as well. And I have to say, uh, some of these games are a lot better in the arcades and some of them are just eh. Golden Axe, I really didn't notice a huge difference. At, the backgrounds were very, very nice on the arcade. Um, they also showed you kind of who Alex was, which I thought was kind of cool, if you remember me joking about that last time. Altered Beast, however, was good god, greatly improved. I, I had a much better understanding, not a perfect understanding, but a much better understanding of why they would choose Altered Beast as the pack-in title after I uh, saw the arcade version. I could see where that would be popular back then. It was a little hard to picture before, when you had no choice but to compare it to things like, well, it's, the main thing I was comparing it to is, look at what Nintendo was doing, look at Mario. Is there any Mario game that you think Altered Beast is at the same quality as, or do you think Mario games are generally above Altered Beast in quality? I'm a huge Sega fanboy, I'm, I am dead loyal to Sega, but even I have to admit, I mean, Mario is the better game. Especially for a pack-in. I'm not going to beat this game if I keep dying. Understatement of the year. Oh no, don't do that. Just help separate them. I love that. I think that's my favorite one. I like that even better than the dragon. The level one magic looks the coolest. I just love how pagan it looks. It's so cool. I don't think I've ever seen like level 
two and three magic, or four or five for that matter. I can't remember what any of those were. Well, wait, two was the one that had like the ghost, right? I think that's what it was. There's a couple of them I don't think I've ever seen because if if I've saved up that much, I'm saving up to get to level six.